Woman, the musical is based on one of Hollywood's most iconic romantic stories. It tells the story of an escort and a wealthy businessman who, over the course of working together, find true love. Well, now the musical is here in San Diego. Here with us today is Olivia Valley, who plays the leading woman, Vivian Ward. Thank you so much, Olivia, for joining us here on The Four. Thank you for having me. I'm so excited to be here. Uh, glad to have you here in town along with the production. I know you've been doing this for almost a year now, but how's the show been going here in San Diego so far? Well, we're actually right now in Tucson, Arizona. We head to San Diego on Monday. Oh, God, I've been with about. Sandy. I've been, I've performed in San Diego before with Wicked, and I remember just audiences going wild, and so I'm very excited to get back to a town that is very appreciative of theater. Oh, we can't wait to have you here. So, okay, I read, though, Olivia, that you actually auditioned for a different role and then you were brought back to audition for the lead role. So what was that moment like for you when they're suddenly throwing the Vivian script at you? It was wild. I mean, I initially auditioned for Kit DeLuca. And so it was crazy for me because I never expected to be considered for Vivian, let alone any Julia Roberts part. And so I just said, I'm ready to do good work. I'm ready to knock this out of the park. And luckily, they liked a little bit of uh, what I call Jersey Ward. It's a little bit of New Jersey and Vivian Ward. <laughs> <laughs> well, speaking of Jersey, you've also been with Jersey Boys. But help me understand this. Is it true that you have a real life relation to the character that you were cast for in Jersey Boys? Yeah, so Frankie Valley's my grandpa uh, and Mary Delgado wow. is my grandma. So I am the only person in theater history to have played a direct relative of somebody on stage. That's amazing. Okay, so you yeah. are playing your real life grandma on stage. What was it like uh, to tell your relatives, this is who I've just been cast as? It was insane. I mean, I had been auditioning for Jersey Boys for six years. And so to finally get it was just the opportunity of a lifetime. And I had been auditioning for my Aunt Francine. And so this was my first time auditioning for my Nana. And it just all felt so surreal, but the ultimate way to honor my family's legacy. Oh my God, oh, six years of auditioning yeah. when you Long had time. the last name and they made you yeah. wait that long. It goes to show though that you were hired based on your incredible talent. What was it like to step into this role as Vivian for you? I mean, the costume changes, the character really morphs throughout the whole show. It was, it was hard in a good way. You know, it was my first time leading a show, so I, I'm figuring out, and I figured out how to be a leading lady. You know, naturally, you're going to fall under the Julia Robert comparisons, but Vivian, our Vivian is a more elevated take because it's a musical, and it's a Jerry Mitchell musical, and for those who don't know, he has done Kinky Boots, Hairspray, On Your Feet, Catch Me If You Can. So, like, he's known for big, full-out productions, and so yeah. my character is big and full-out, and, you know, if you want exactly Julia Roberts, that's more than fine, but go home and see the movie. I <laughs> got it. <laughs> Olivia Valley, we are flat out of time here, but one final quick question. What is the yeah. strangest thing I would find in your dressing room? Ooh, I have lots of Lay's potato chips because that's what I eat in between shows because it helps keep my vocal cords nice and oiled up for the show. I'm going to use that excuse too when you see me walking down the hallway here with a bag of potato chips. I Olivia Valley, <laughs> Vivian Ward in the brand new Pretty Woman the Musical. It's starting here in San Diego on Monday and runs all the way through the 31st. We'll see you in town. Thank you, Olivia. Thank you.